Breakfast and books, two things that mean more to families now more than ever before. Today, U City Family Zone's new COVID response group showed some love for their neighbors in the Orchard Trace community. A reporter Elsa Gillis and photojournalist Carl McLean were there and saw the joy on everyone's faces. We have a saying at Hill Charlotte is if everybody does a little bit, nobody would have to do a lot. We do what we can. Um, thank y'all and y'all have a blessed day. You too. Have, have a great day. day. Have a blessed day. Well, today we are feeding the community with a hundred hot meals of breakfast that are provided by the Uptown Yoke Cafe in 7th Street Market. Are you hearing that it's hard for people to access food right now? Absolutely, absolutely. Um, there's a lack in everything right now. I feel passionate about those who um, can't get to getting something to eat. We know that there is a lot of families uh, who probably uh, went, went to bed hungry. Especially now. Yeah, especially, especially now, now. That they, don't, they cannot travel. I, was, I just work. I work at Purdue Farms in Concord. So I'm just constantly working to provide. This is great with what they're doing to provide. I, I think it's very great. And so you got some books for the kids? Oh, yes. I got one. The cell phone. So hopefully keep her mind occupied and keep her focused on other things as well. Just make sure they be happy and just keep focused on, yeah. on their education. That's important. Wherever you can step up and try to serve and be salt to the earth right now, it's the opportune time to do that. Stay safe, be wise about how you're serving, but also take advantage of the opportunity to just show some love to your neighbor. That is awesome, right? And right now, for this particular effort, they've raised enough money to provide bre breakfast for eight weeks. Now, the money is going to help the restaurants to help them out, and in turn, they give the food to those in need.